Hi friends, welcome to my YouTube channel. So, in this video, we will learn about time complexity for independent loops and dependent loops. Okay, so I have many videos in data structure and analysis of algorithms. So, I am getting constant feedbacks from this. In many videos, daily data structures and daily algorithm analysis video. I am getting many subscribers from this video. So, I am very happy. And please excuse me. I will upload as soon as possible. So, next, next. Coming weeks lah, nana raya videos onde upload pandra. And very big thank you for the subscribers and who are watching my channel. Okay, so coming to this concept, time complexity. So time complexity for independent loops and dependent loops. So time complexity na enna. So ning onde or basic operation orda count onde nama calculate pani. Okay, so calculate money, other one the notations la represent pandra the TN value. Okay, so time complexity about the separate explanation on good trick or a separate video la. So, you know, other one the path to come up. So, time complexity in the sense, what is actual time taken by the algorithm in terms of its input size? Okay, nama input size a base pani and I'm not algorithm and the evlo time execute a hapo the. அப்படிங்கிறதாம் வந்து time complexity definition and coming to this video so இந்த விடியோல் நம்ம் என்ன பாக்கப் போரும் அப்படினா எப்படி வந்து time complexity வந்து ஒரு loop loop பேச் பண்ணிதான் நம்ம வந்து TN value கண்டு பிடிப்போம் என்ன loopலதா வந்து basic operation வந்து இருக்கும் so basic operation in the sense what most frequently executing statement Okay, so terumbu terumbu, itu yang the statement jasia execute awal tu, anda statement itu na, anda basic operation tu solu. So definite a, orang algoritma la, orang loop perindicce abdi, na, anda loop kuller kira statement itu na, anda basic operation. And ni ngan anda basic operation orang count a calculate paniting abdi, na, t n value ni ngan easya calculate panila. So ini tu muna di na, orang video potrikan, so how to calculate the time complexity for simple for loop na. Seria, orang china for loop algorithm, orang algorithm mereka, ala orang orang for loop mereka, okay? I varies from one to n, abdi orang for loop mereka. So, anda algorithm ke, every time complexity calculate pandra ni potron eh? So, in the video la, anda, orang complicated, so nested for loop mereka abdi macam la. Okay, aduk mandi abdi nama time complexity calculate pandra de, abdi ni pakai pono. So, I think the introduction is very lengthy. So, nama segera nama video kita pergi la. So, first nama potong ke approach. That is first loop mandi very simple. So, one second please. Yes. So, first in the for loop ni tuk tau abdi na. So, orang lek tariu. So, ini pato orang ni orang assume this is going to be your basic operation. Okay, so you do a count and you can do this thing, TN value is easier to do this. So TN value is the basic operation count. Okay, so how do you do this loop count? So it's going to be very simple for this approach. So in the type of nested for loop, what do you do this type of nested for loop? So in the type of nested for loop, what do you do this type of nested for loop? Independent loops, what do you do this type of nested for loop? Okay, so ये इधर कौन दी independent loop अपडिंग रहमना, so outer loop को inner loop में वंदे यंदे विधा माना relation हो इल्ला, okay, so it is not going to inner loop is not going to depend on the outer loop, चलिए आसो outer loop कितने time execute आप हो दे यंदे times, right ना, so अध कुल्लर का loop कितने time execute आप हो दे यंदे times Right? So, so, n into m is the count. So, basic operation is the count n into m. Very simple. So, in the previous video, I will explain to you. Right? So, n is the i value m times. Okay? So, i varies from 1 to n. Okay? One of the i value is the number of m times in the print of execute. So, total count is n into m. So, this is the T of n. T of n is going to be n m. Order of n m. Okay. So, this for loop is very simple approach. Independent loop is here. In your algorithm, there are independent nested loops. 
nested for loop irukku appadina your calculation is going to be very simple okay neenga vandu romba easy ah vandu tn value kandupidichiralam eppadi indha na solliten so idhu vandu 1 la rendu vary aagudhu so 1 la rendu vary aagradhanaala n nu potrukken sometimes it might be here 10 to n appdi irukum okay so 10 la rendu n varaila so adha vandu na next video la ungalku vandu explain pandren so 1 la rendu n illama vera madri values inge start aayirukku starting value vandu 1 illama irundhuchu na eppadi nama calculate pananum abingiradha na next video la podren so as far as this uh, for loop is concerned it's going to be very simple 1 to n so n times 1 to m so m times so idhai neenga check panikkanum plus 1 la increment avadhaan adhu important okay m times is. so print of statement rendukku ulla irukiradunala idhu dhaan basic operation okay so inge nariya statements irukalam inge nariya statements irukalam nam adalla vittralam okay nama concentrate panna poradhu only the basic operation okay other things are going to act as a constant okay so basic operation so basic operation ennadhu inge n into m so tn value um, order of n m vandru seriya yeah. so idu vandu romba simple approach now moving to the uh, next uh, example so next example pathinga na so this is again a uh, uh, nested for loop tha so idu vandu so this is again a nested for loop so idu vandu independent la varadu ena inge i vandu inge depend a irukku yeah so based on the i value i am going to iterate my k iterate my k na and i am going to repeat my k based on the i value so in the type of uh, loop ku peru dependent for loop okay so in the mari for loops undu unga program la irukku so this is going to be very very important concept nariya uh, interview questions la vande algorithm kuduthu time complexity calculate panna solluvanga so adha vande pathina ungaloda basic operation enga irukku ngradha neenga vande identify pannite adukapra adu enthra loops ku la irukku abingradha identify pannite and the loop oda variables eppadi vande vary avudhu abingradha neenga identify pannitinga na t of n value easy ah kandupidichiralam okay so coming to this uh, loop so idu idu enna type na dependent for loop type la varudhu okay yen dependent appdin solrona ulle iruka for loop vandu that is inner for loop is going to have your outer for loop variable so idha base panni da nama inner for loop ah nama iterate pandrom okay so to make it simple uh, first for loop etna time execute aga podu n times ungalku theriyum okay so second for loop etna time execute aga podu appadina i times okay so based on the i value i am going to execute my k okay so in the print of oda count enna that is the question today okay so in the print of value oda so what is the question is find the count of print of in the print of okay so the question so find the count so etna time in the print of statement execute aga podu okay abdingra count neenga kandupidichitinga na adil irundhu nama vandu notation ku nama vandu implement panikalam best case la eppadi nama represent pannu best case la eppadi represent pandradendrada nama derive panikalam okay first you want to know the count of your basic operation yeah so idha yeah. enoda basic operation so idoda count enna ngradha neenga kandupidikkrom that is the question now okay how to solve that problem so eppadi vandu idha count kandupidikkrathu okay so i will make it very simple so na ye simple ana for loop eduthirukena ungaloda process vandu easy ah irukanum ngiradha na simple ana for loop eduthiruken so ungalku inda concept understand aayiduchu na endha mari complicated for loop ayum kuda neenga potukalam okay so let me uh, uh, write the iteration process step by step so that it will be easy for you na iteration vandu step by step ah eludhena na ungalku vandu konjam easy ah puriyum so iteration number okay so i value i value so k value okay, i value in a k value in a 
and count. Okay, so this is in our tabular column. So quicker, we will fill it with the fill. So that you uh, will be easy to understand. So first iteration 1. First iteration. So first iteration. I order value in 1. This is iteration number. This is I order value. I order value in 1. So I 1 is equal to K order value in 1. Okay. So count in 1. Very simple. Okay. Second iteration. La, second iteration. La, I order value in 1. So, first iteration la, nama i vandu 1 in rikana la, k ethra times repeat ahu pothu, 1 time thar repeat ahu. Okay, because k less than or equal to i in kudut rikana. Ayanala k 1 da. Okay, so count to 1 da. Ore ur da da da, in the print of vandu execute ahu. Ipa iteration number 2 la, i vandu 2 in vach da. So, i equal to 2 abdi na, in the arthala 2 vandu. Right ah. So, k oda value enna 1 comma 2. First 1 in irukko, aduthu 2 in irukko. Right, I k equal to 1, k less than or equal to i. I know that I 1, 2 in put. So, first time 1, second time 2. So, how many time print of statement execute out of the day? 2 times execute out of the Means that how many numbers in here? How many are 2 in So, 2 times we will execute the print of the day. So, first 1, k 1 in one time, k 2 in second time so how many times you are going to execute your print of statement so two times you are going to execute okay so third iteration i equal to 3 so k value on the 1 comma 2 comma 3 so yethana time k nam print of statement execute out the three times execute out okay if do you the next okay say for example i Adhe mari i pôr So i, i th iteration. Okay, in the i ko, in the i ko relate panna di ngay. Idho i th iteration. So 1, 2, 3 goes to i th iteration. So ethana time nama print of statement repeat ava pôdhu. i times repeat ava pôdhu. Of course, in the last value kuda define mani kela. Okay, so in the last value, one day ethana times nama count. Okay, you know, i times repeat panna pora nada, i times na nammaloda count to aru. Okay, likewise, n minus 1, so n minus 1 iteration. So, n varayil unge namma panna nao, right? So, iteration number vandhu 1, 2, 3, i, n minus 1, n varayil namma panna nao. Yen n varayil panna nao, n is the input size. So, idhala nama previous video le unge lukku explain panna nao, nama vittu ta inge sol rathukku. So, n is the input size. So, i varies from 1 to n. So, i varies from 1 to n. i varies from 1 to n. Okay. So, n minus 1 na n, n minus 1 iterations varayil namma panna nao. Okay, count n n minus 1 time. Okay, n minus 1 times nama panna poro. i times panna poro. Panna poro. And the marida ninga read panna no. Okay, so if a n la vandu 1, 2, 3, n times, n times nama panna poro. Right, huh? so nama table la fill panna yach. So this is going to be very, very important table. Okay, so uh, this is the first for loop order variable, second for loop, inner for loop order variable, and count of your uh, print of. Okay, print of ethana time repeat up, the count of first time, second time, third time, n minus one time, n times. Okay, now we will find the count of print of. So, this is the count of print of. So, this is the sum of the count of print of. So, count in a total count in a country. Okay. So, this is the first iteration order count. Second iteration order count. Third iteration order count. Count. Nth iteration order count. Okay. So, this is the total value that is sum. This is the total count. 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 Yes. So, now we have to do the total count. So, say for example, T of n. So, I am going to write T of n. So, T of n. So, you will explain this time complexity. So, time taken 
based on the inputs ungalaoda answer vandu enna base panni mattum dhaan irukanum okay so you have to write your answer only in terms of n so that is going to be your input size okay summation of i varies from 1 to n of i okay so nam ide eppadi nam vandu eludrom so how you are going to read this expression in english okay epayume vandu or expression vandu neenga formula madri paakama eppadi vandu nam adha vandu english layo illa tamil layo understand pannikiradhu abdingradha mukkiyam okay so nam 1 to n so adha ellathai neenga sum panninga abdina count da sum pananum i ye neenga vandu sum panna vendam okay of course rendume same neenga answer la pathinga na value and this value same right so i can uh, uh, write this in terms of i okay very simple so t of n equal to sum of i equal to 1 to n i so na i ellathaiyum sum panna pore apdi sum panna da enak inda count kadikum okay so i eppadi na sum pannano na so let me uh, tell you so eppadi nama pannuvom so 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus i plus n minus 1 plus n okay got it so this is how you need to implement so idha da nam ipdi eludhirukom ivlo persa eludha mudiyilla ngradunala nam ipdi eludhirukom seriya so neenga vandu formula nu paaka koodadha okay so idha idellathai na add pananum inda inda row ella inda particular row ellathai na add pananum so epdi add pananum ipdi add pananum so idha vandu simple ah understand panikiradha na epdi eludhirukom okay now coming to the next uh, value so idukku vandu namakku summation oda formula ungalku erkenave theriyum so it's going to be n into n plus 1 by 2 in the for in the mari summation series irukku appadina adukku idhu dhaan vandu formula so n into n plus 1 by 2 you already know right so uh, i am going to substitute that it's going to be n square plus n by 2 and uh, my answer is in the worst case big one podra n square edutten okay so this is going to be my final uh, uh, answer for uh, this problem so inda mari da neenga problem ah approach pananum so na step by step ah edukku ungalku explain pandren appadina oru oru term um undu easy ah ungalku vandu understand panikkanum okay so next uh, video la vandu so we are going to see a more complicated for loop okay na previous video la romba simple la ore ore for loop potu na basic operation execute panni ungalku tn value explain panninde overlapping so dependent for loop vachu nama eppadi basic operation pandradunnradha paathom next video la vandu so in the term one ah illa abina say for example in the term la vandu vera endha say for example 100 nu irukalam 200 nu irukalam okay so inge vandu vera maadhiri plus 3 nu kuda irukalam plus 3 plus 4 nu kuda irukalam okay so andha mari for loops ku vandu eppadi basic operation kandupidikiradhu abingiradha next video la clear ah paakalam okay thank you students thanks for watching my video bye